Let's talk about USB-C cable. Yo, what's up guys? It's me, Mr. Kim here. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I have another exciting unboxing. Okay, not very exciting, but it's just a USB Type-C from No Man. Why is this special? Because it's stated as a rugged strength. And this cable can output a 4K HD video, 100 volt output and extra rugged nylon. And No Man said that they have tested out to 4000 flex at 150 angle and it still works like a charm. And the next thing is this cable produces high speed which means that it can output not only 100 watt charging and it also have a chip that can read USB Type-C 3.1 Gen 2 data up to 10 gigabit. So this is also serve it as a fast data transfer cable. So once you pull out the box, straight away the first thing you see is the cable itself, and it's tied up with just two sticker label no man. So let's see what's written behind. Of course, the back is just a beautiful illustration like a terrain kind of thing. And the write-up is basically the company philosophy. I must say the outer box design looks quite cool. First thing I realized when you're holding this cable is actually quite thick. It's thicker compared to the original Apple cable. First of all, I believe it's because you, when they can deliver so much power, they will need a thicker cable like this. And not only that, I like how flexible it can be fold. Look at how I fold, it can stay in shape. And the only bad side I would say is that this cable it comes only in one meter long. When you're charging that time, make sure that your power socket is very near your laptop or your iPad. The color is quite stealthy, it's all in full black, even down to label the logo. Over here, I have my 2019 MacBook Air. So right now, I'm just going to use this cable and test it. Because this output is 64 watt, this cable can even charge up your MacBook Pro 15 inch. And absolutely no problem with it. So next time, I'm going to use the same cable to charge up my iPad Pro. So, like I said earlier, you and you can charge up your well, 15 inch MacBook Pro. I don't think there's an issue for charging a 12.9 inch iPad Pro. So, next up, I'm going to try with my SSD using this cable to do a data transfer and also using the Samsung one that they come with it. Just do a speed test and see whether we are faster because it has, like I mentioned earlier, it stated a 3.1 Gen 2 USB Type C. So it should be faster. So right now, I actually spin to two clips. The upper one will be the no main, and the bottom one will be the default Samsung cable. Of course, both seems to be running at a very good speed. So I believe using a naked eye won't be able to see. So right now I'm just going to use my stopwatch to see how fast can it run. So surprise, surprise, both of them are actually about the same. So that makes me wonder that whether the cable is it through 3.1 because it's that fast speed. Even the Samsung cable comes with it, runs at the same speed. Of course, I'm out of my curiosity. I decided to use these. MacBook charger cable which is also USB type C when it can charge definitely you can try to use it as a data transfer right and surprise result that I get the default USB type C charging cable from Apple surprisingly runs at a very very slow rate as you can see from the result it took 1 minute 49 seconds to finish up a 4 gig file whereas the USB type C 3.1 gen 2 runs at only 10 seconds so what's the bottom line just to make sure that when you purchase a USB type C ensure the box has stated the 
charging ward at the USB speed just to ensure you get best of both worlds you got to pay a premium price for it and this is the cable from no man all right guys that's the end of my video if you like this video make sure you slap a like button subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you in my next video okay thanks bye